This is the bow transom. There's the top framing which is narrow and the bottom framing which is wide. See this is the wide framing and this is the narrow framing for the top. It's already planed down to be a kind of triangular shape. It fits in the notch at the top of the side tank panel and lines up with the reference lines. Now I'm moving the reference line over to match the plywood of the side tank. Once it's in position, you have to check the height. The height of the side tank ply there has to be the same as the height of the bow transom there. Once it's in, you can put in the screws and then move to the other side. Check the top again. This is the stern transom. The narrow framing is at the top and the wide framing is at the bottom. Again, it lines up with the pencil line on the stern transom, but the notch at the bottom edge is too narrow. So mark the height of the framing. and draw a line square to the back edge of the side tank panel and then draw a line upwards to mark out the corner that has to be cut. The stern transom goes on and lines up carefully with the pencil line and then it's screwed in place. The whole thing is very wobbly and will remain wobbly until the decks go on. This is something we have to watch out for.